Now, first warning weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. So we got some more snow today. We sure did. Yeah. I mean, this has been kind of relentless. I've seen a few uh, emails coming in saying, you know, it's two inches, two and a half, three inches, but a lot of them in the valley. So, yeah. you know, it keeps on keeping on out there. I think we're going to get through tonight, get into tomorrow. We're going to have one more day of this. And then by the weekend, it's definitely going to be pulling back on the snow situation. But I don't know if you've heard, it's going to get way colder over the weekend. All right, hold that thought for just a minute. I'm sure you feel like doing that. Anyway, we do still have some snow around. Not seeing too much in Plattsburgh right now. A little bit, you can see it with uh, some of the street lights going on. Meanwhile, as you get into Franklin County, yeah, you can head right on down to Mount Mansfield. Some of the ski areas, again, I think doing pretty well, and it's not just to the north, on down to the south as well. A lot of this is really light stuff as you head on down toward, uh, oh, say places like Manchester, down into Bennington. Not too much going on off to the east, but I know there certainly have been some snowflakes there. So we're not quite done. You can see upstream where the weather is coming from that we've got more. So just be careful out there. I'm telling you, the uh, roads, at least around here in northern New York, they have been sketchy at best. Here's where we are for temperatures. We still have teens up in the Northeast Kingdom, but we're well into the 20s right in the Champlain Valley. And for some, if not a lot of people in northern New York, it's interesting because temperatures not exactly going down tonight. That's going to be the case for everybody. We've got a 28 right now, Brattleboro, Rutland at 24. But watch this with the 12 hour forecast in the Champlain Valley. Not only are temperatures not going down, we think they're going to come up a little bit tonight. We've got warmer air that's going to come in, so very mild for this time of year. We've got a mild day tomorrow with some snow showers, and then after that, it gets colder just in time for the weekend. So here's what we're thinking on Saturday, some mountain snow showers, maybe a few snowflakes in the valley. It's going to be breezy, not only Saturday, but Sunday. The high Saturday, 18. Sunday is going to be the brighter of the two weekend days, 17 degrees, but with the breezy conditions, it's going to feel a lot colder than that. Here's the deal for tomorrow. A few snow showers around, even in the valley. I think we do find more in the mountains and temperatures in the 30s, so we will take it. This is Futurecast. That is tonight. A few snow showers around. Snow showers again tomorrow, accumulating snows. We think more likely in the mountains. And here comes Saturday. Saturday is going to be a cloudy day, but still a few snow showers up in the mountains, not expecting much right in the valleys. So we'll take you right through Friday and then into Saturday. And again, down the spine of the Green Mountains and the western Adirondack, especially the northwestern portion, we're looking at another three to six, I think, in a bunch of spots. So first warning weather tonight, some snow showers around temperatures. Well, where they are right now and then actually rising some for tomorrow. Some snow showers 33 right in the valley, quite a bit warmer on down to the south. It's kind of a one off here because after that it does get colder because we go from 33 to 18 with those mountain snow showers Saturday night cold into Sunday morning 17 for a high on Sunday. Monday, Tuesday, at least we're knocking on the door of 20 degrees and then it's going to be pretty cold. Upper teens to low 20s for a number of days, but most of them look dry.